Hey everybody, welcome back to Big Red EDC and welcome to this edition of Saturday Night Live. I know, right? It's a little different tonight, isn't it? Man, you guys have been kicking off this chat like no tomorrow. Get a little, there we go. Wow. You guys hear me okay? Everything good? Let me know if I'm not in the not in the game tonight, but I think we should be okay. Oh, who do we have? Yeah, I know I probably scared the crap out of KJ. But man, we got some awesome, awesome folks in the lighting up the live chat early tonight. Wow, you guys have been amazing. Zach and Top Dog. Man, Sobix. Man, you guys were just lighting it up early off. Thank you so much very much you guys are absolutely awesome uh i haven't even started this and y'all are kicking off this super chat but who do we have in there oh well i don't know i don't know about handsome but it's definitely a face <laughs> but let's see who do we have in here already i mean we had zach of course we had zach the moderator extraordinaire a uh, one minute knife review top dog kj dda David Iverson was here, Eggs and Ham, George French, Rick was here, Z-Man, what is up? Oh, did I get everybody that was here early? Man, you guys were like, George French, yeah, George was here lighting it up early. Man, you guys are absolutely awesome. Sobix was here. Let's see, who do we have now? Paper Tiger, welcome. Christine, the lovely and wonderful Christine. Thank you very much for being here tonight. RJ is here. Mark Herrera is here. Man, Zach Zeb's here. Zach is just lighting it up tonight. Holy smokes. My goodness. Thank you so much. Yeah, you know, it's a little bit different tonight. I decided I decided to go face forward tonight. Well, because honestly, it was kind of a slow week for stuff. I don't have a whole lot to show you, so I figured, you know, It'd be a good, uh, be a good night just to chat. Good night just to chat. Manny's here. Hello, Manny. Got to make sure I get everybody. You guys are absolutely awesome. Jared White's here. Average Knife Guy. Hello, Paper Tiger. Chris Wolf. Of course, Mr. Grateful Panic himself. Logan is here. Very cool. Rodney. Marcos. Hello. Rusty is here. I seem to always forget Winchester. So if Winchester is here... I'm going to say hi to him. I don't think he is. Hey, Triple E, what's up? I know. Sue, Mike Schultz, hello. Todd Carr, Stuart, welcome. Welcome to you all. Scott, hello. Welcome. Oh, uh, yeah, you know, I figured I would just kind of go, I'd go kind of face forward tonight. Like I said, not a whole lot as far as gear and stuff to show tonight. Got a couple of things we're definitely going to take a look at. Tim Cook, hello. Jan, Hello. Welcome, welcome. Everybody's jumping in. So very cool. Don C is here. Right on. Uh, let me know, guys. I got the fans on again. So let me know if that background noise is too much for you. You know, I just want to make sure it's really, really stuffy in this room like it always is. So, yes, dudes and dudettes. That is correct. We do have some dudettes with us tonight. So very cool. Yes. Oh, thank you very much, Zach. All of you guys, the Big Reds Brigade. Guys, I thank you so, so very much. Uh, hey, Scott Benefield, what is up? Uh, man, you guys are really, really helping out the channel um, with your with your monthly donations. I greatly, greatly appreciate it. Um, you, you just don't know. Hello, Manette. Hello. Welcome. Um, all of you guys, everybody with the red stars next to your name, thank you so much. You know, all of you that watch, all of you that comment, like the videos and everything like that, man, that helps out so much. You know, a special shout out to those brigade members. I just, I, I really, really can't thank you guys enough. So, great stuff. Always appreciated. Oh, my goodness. We're just loading it up. Very, very cool. I know it's a little weird. It's, a, it, it's really a lot for me to get used to. I, I'm trying to look over here and talk to you guys, so... But we're going to have fun with it. Hey, Top Dog. Oh, my God. <laughs> to be brave enough to show my face. Yeah, I know. I know it's probably not everything anybody wants to see. But you know what? 
I'm going to make you suffer through it, especially KJ. Underground EDC, what is up? How are you? Glad to have you. Man, you guys are awesome. I don't know if you guys uh, were on earlier. Oh, KC, man. Thank you so much. Thank you, KC. Give KC a little bit of love there. Um, John, Grateful Panic was just live, and he had our very, very good friend, Justin, uh, Blue Collar Survival on, of course. Some of you remember Sales Guy. Oh, man, it was really, really, really good to see Justin. That was awesome and very cool. I, I'm so glad you had him on. Uh, John, that was that was very cool. Something just fell over. I don't know what. Anyway, <laughs> um, that was very oh Sovix man, welcome. Let's welcome Sovix to the brigade. Thank you so much. Welcome, my friend. Oh, one too many. Wouldn't let me do that one. All right. Thank you so much. I greatly appreciate that. Very very much. New member of the brigade, Sobix. Hey, Sobix, do me a favor, man. Uh, email me, bigrededc at gmail.com. I got a swag pack out for you. I'll get a swag pack out to you, you know, stickers, all that good stuff. So just make sure to email me, bigrededc at gmail.com. Very cool. Greatly appreciate it, guys. Um, I, I don't know if you guys noticed. Oh, hey, Alex. Alex and I and stuff. Z-Man. Man. You guys are going to let me talk. You're just going to make me show love all night. Hey, I can do that. I can show love all night long. Thank you so much, Z-Man. Thank you, thank you. Jesse B. Oh, good to have you, my friend. Always good to see you. And Cauldron. Cauldron's jumping in as well. Excellent. Um, now I lost my place. Don't even know where I was. Anyway, whatever. That's kind of it's kind of the way it's been going. Hey, Jeremy, what is up? Jeremy Spaulding's here. I don't think I've said... Oh, C. Lemansky's here, too. What's up, buddy? Very good to see you. But, uh... Oh, it's been... It's been an interesting week, guys. Very interesting week. Um, I know I put a... <laughs> put a video out on... What was it? Thursday or Friday, whatever it was. And I kind of... I, I really, really... To, ugh, I, I really contemplated not putting that video out. Uh, but I really... I just decided I was going to go ahead uh, for the simple fact that I had gotten so many um, contacts about doing something for John, which, yes, I am doing something for John. But, guys, I'm kind of it, it's not going to be that super blown out. Um, I just yeah, I, I'm not up for that right now, guys. I'm sorry. I called, I talked to John, I had a nice long conversation with him. Uh, oh, is Katie here? Oh, Katie, did I miss you coming in? Sorry, if I did, there she is. Hello, Katie. Welcome. Um, Yeah, it, it's just, I, I love John. John knows I love him. Um, but guys, this is not something I'm looking to take on right now. And we're going to do what we're going to do. And hey, Beefer, what is up? So, yes, I'm going to do something that will probably be out on Monday. I'm putting together some stuff. Uh, got, so, got some stuff. Well, it's kind of back there on the table right now. Uh, Factors of Jack, what's up, buddy? Welcome, welcome. So, yes, there is, there is the Grateful Panic GoFundMe. Thank you very much, Zach. I tell you what, guys, if you donate to that at any time before... The raffle comes out. Please save your receipt, send it to me, and and I'll I will enter you into the raffle. This is about helping John. I mean, this is that's what it's about. Um, and it's gonna be the same as, as they always are. You know, for f every five dollars you donate, you get an entry into the raffle, that type of thing. But uh, yeah, do it now if, if you if you just got paid and got a couple extra bucks and want to give up, like Zach always says, want to give up your coffee for Sunday morning. Go make a donation to that GoFundMe. Uh, send me the receipt at BigRateEDC at gmail.com, and we'll get you entered into the into the raffle. There's going to be some good stuff. I, I, oh, I know what I was talking about beforehand. Hey, Lorenzo. Welcome, buddy. Tom's here, too. Welcome, Tom. Um, I 
I kind of called this one Super Swag Saturday. Super Swag SKL. That's what, kind of what I named this one. Um, we're going to have some fun tonight. Uh, we're going to have a, an awesome giveaway. It's going to be full, chuck full of Big Red EDC swag. I got some cool stuff to give away tonight. So a little bit different. Probably won't be a knife. Probably won't be a, a flashlight. I'll just tell you that right now in case you want to bounce. Hey, but there's going to be some really, really good stuff. Hey, Topher, what's up, buddy? Welcome. So and now I need a drink. I know I showed this one earlier, but man, one of the guys at work, his wife made me this. This is so cool. And there's even one on the bottom. How cool is that? So even when I drink, we're repping Big Red EDC. You know what I'm saying? So very cool. So shout out to Lori and to Eric. This is really, really cool. Thank you so, so very much. So. <laughs> Sorry, one minute. That's the way it is. That's the way it is tonight. So, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Eggs and ham. Bad news. No. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yes, GoFundMe. Uh, oh, Rusty. Welcome back, my friend. Welcome back to the brigade, brother. I know you've been not feeling too well recently, but welcome back to the brigade. Always appreciate your support, my friend. So, yes, uh, Monster Racing did reopen his GoFundMe, too. Apparently, he was laid off as well. So, yeah, yeah, tough times all around. It, it just, it's crazy. Crazy world we live in, but you know what? Uh, we were talking about that on Grateful Panic's uh, giveaway. So, ah, no worries, Rusty. No worries, my friend. Um, you know, uh, you know, people don't realize that we've all, all got something going on. And, you know, we do our best. Hey, Mariana, we do our best to help one another out. And, you know, that's kind of why I, what I was saying about it. I really didn't, I really... I really contemplated not putting that video out, but I wanted everybody to know uh, the reason why I wasn't going all out this time. I mean, and I got several messages um, on the other side hey, saying, hey, man, we understand. And that, and that was very cool of you. And but like I said, I, uh, I, I made sure I talked to John before I did it. Uh, just to let him know, um, as, as you guys know, John is, you know, he's probably one of the, oh, him, Justin, they've got, they're the guys that I've known the longest in this crazy, crazy YouTube world. And I just wanted to know that I, I I'll be perfectly honest with you guys. And, and this is no lie, no lie. Uh, when I was talking to him that night, explaining it to him, I was pretty much on the verge of tears. I, I really was because I wanted to do more, but the timing just sucks. It really does. Hey, CK, how you doing? So, I mean, it, that's the honest truth, guys. It really is. Um, it was it was not an easy conversation for me to have. It really wasn't. I'll be I'll be perfectly honest with you. And I mean, and that's my goal. I, I'm not going to hide anything. I'm not going to, I'm not going to sugarcoat anything. Hey, Russ, welcome. I mean, that's just the way it was, you know? So, oh, well, let's talk about, some, no, let's do a, let's do a pocket check. What was everybody carrying? Let's get that out of the way. Let's get our pocket check out of the way. And I'll show you what I was carrying. And then we'll, uh, we'll go from there. Oh, I hear you, Zeb. I hear you. I hear you, man. Let's hear what everybody was carrying. I'll kind of... All right, here we go. Didier's got the TRM Adam. Very cool. Jared's got the orange damn design gin. Red Rit Dye Fade job. Oh, nice. Scout carried with an Artisan Cutlery Sea Snake. Nice. Off-grid rapid fire for Top Dog. TS-301 for Eggs and Ham. CK's got the mini, mini Adamas. Nice. 
MBK Easy C for Miss Christine. Excellent. Mini Archbishop. Nice. One minute. Oh, Blue Bug Out. Good old Blue Bug Out for Z Man. TRM Adam. Minty PM3. And a normal Sack Field Master for KJ. Nice. Beefer's got the Takuna. Kershaw Atmos for Logan. Case Copperhead. With a Roper Pecos hybrid for RJ. Very nice. Rusty's got the Shaman. A pair of three of Maximant and a Victorinox Pioneer X. Yes, I have a Pioneer X to show you as well. Benchmade Barrage and a Case Sow Belly for David. Kara Kara Rescue 2. Nice, Stuart. Leatherman Skeletool CX for Factors of Jack. Very good. Steel Wheel Intrigue for Manette. Very cool. Weep here and a Bigfoot Tinker. Nice. Very nice. Where'd it go? I lost it. There it is, Jeremy. <laughs> PM2 and Maximit and my card at Tinker for Andrew. Very nice. Welcome, Andrew. Ontario Till Attack 1A. Nice. Beater Saturday. Very good. 940-2 for Scott. Barrage and the Adamas for Lorenzo. Very good. Triple E's got the Shiragorov 110 kickstop. And a ZT0392. Oh, right. Manny's got the Adam. Oh. Oh, no. We're all good, John. We're all good, my friend. Asher flashback for Tim. Very cool. Master Out Buck for Mick. Hello, Mick. How are you? Rat 2 and a QSP Penguin and Denim My Carter. Yes. Grand Ace and a Slim Midi for Chris. Nice. Civivi Imperium and Copper for Russ. Nice. Average Knife Guy. Got the home, so you got the Chair Knife, More Knife Companion. There you go. It's a good companion to have. Napster Ninja's got the Deca. Last Ranger's got the Civivi Kai V. I think that's how you say it. Kai V, is that how you say it? I think so. Ho oh, K390, or K320, excuse me, for Knives Fast. And Ben's White Mountain Smooth Bone American Jack. Yeah, that's a nice knife. That's a really nice knife. That's probably my favorite one out of those four that you were showing. That warning's pretty good, too, though, but I like that American Jack. Uh, Formax Scout, Leatherman Surge, and a Tucson TS-16, and a Gerber Dime for Todd. Mike Schultz got the Pena Mula. Sue's got the Minimalist, and a dog bone, Rough Rider Dogbone Jack. Nice. Oh, it jumped. Where are we at? James, hello. Mini rug up, bug out for Don C. JN's got the Carbon Finding S90 Native Sheaf. Nice. Kaiser Doman. Launch 6 and an Eldris. Man, you are packing. Nice. <laughs> the Blue Pioneer. Yes, I have my Blue Pioneer X. And no, I'm not sending it to you, KJ. Cheap by Titan Switchblade. Is that, that's better than the Katana. You showed me the other day that you were trying to carry. Let's see. <laughs> That's Paper Tiger. Let's see. What does Zeb got? Zeb got some MILF 01, SAC 7, K bar MK1, K bar 1211, and Leatherman Super Tool 300 in your backpack. Wow. All right. Grateful Panics got the Kaiser Land and a field. Oh, the field trekker. Yes, yes, yes. You like that field trekker. And I see you, Zeb. I, or I see you, Zach, sneaking in there on me. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. Spider Co. Fish Hunter and a bug out now for George. Ontario Rat for Tom. Underground EDC's got the Marauder and the Slim Midi. Benchmade Anthem for K20. What's up, K20? Uh, Benchmade bug out and a Flytanium. Oh, yeah, with the Flytanium crossfade scales for Zach. Nice. Very nice. I3T EOS in your left pocket. Right on, Sobix. That's a good little light. Love it. All right. Did I get them all? I think so. Ooh, Spider Co. Rock for Peter. Hello, Peter. Hi. How are you? Wow, I hope I got them all. I'm way behind, so I got to catch up, guys. If I missed them, throw them back in. I got to catch up with the chat. Oh, there's Jeremy Russell. What's up, Jeremy? Hinder a battle, black fire tech, and the carbon fiber S90V bug out. Nice. Very cool. All right. Oh, all right. What did I have in my pocket? Yes, I did have my Alox Blue Pioneer X. Kind of went with a Swiss Army Saturday theme today. So, what's up, ID? 
Good to have you. Party has started. You're here, man. So, yes, I did carry this today. I do. I love this knife. So, like I said, kind of went with a Swiss Army Saturday. Very cool. Love it, love it, love it. But, but what? But what? What are we button? But what? Save on shipping, send both at the same time. It is blue. I know. It's distressed blue ALOX. It's distressed blue ALOX. It's pretty. What's wrong with that? And then, of course, I got the little Redfish SD Classic. Very cool. I doubled up on the sack scissors today as well. I could. Yeah, that's why. I chose to. Small sack, James Ortiz. Nice. I know, the chat was cooking and it was filling up. That's why I had to kind of catch up with what everybody was was carrying so yeah well no we got the red fish we got the red fish that was the whole reason i carried this guy because it's the red fish i know i had the blue i went heavy on the blue today but i did have the red fish so yes oh your wife likes it no hey she said sh she wouldn't trade me the tinker so she can't have the red fish so no, it's not. It's redfish. It's not bluefish. It's redfish. There's bluefish all over. The only thing that's special is a redfish, so it's redfish. So we'll have to agree to disagree on that one. Exactly, Peter. One fish, two fish, redfish, bluefish. What's under the grass skirt? <laughs> You'll never know. That's my secret. That's my secret. You know, Victoria's got her secret. JB's got his. So there you go. <laughs> I don't know. It sounded good. <laughs> Not much of a secret. Oh, what's tri what's Triple E? What's Triple E saying here? Can someone email me the GoFundMe for Grateful Panic? My email is Triple EBC. You can't copy links. Um... Yeah, if you want to shoot me an email, uh, triple E, big red EDC at gmail.com, I will happily email it to you. Or if somebody wants to email it to him while we're here, please do so, if you will. So that would be awesome. But yeah, I will certainly do that after the chat, bud. If you just want to drop me an email, man. Uh, no problem. No problem. So, so all right. What else are we going to talk about today? Oh, here we go. Let's talk about this. Let's talk about this. Does it have... I'm not telling, Manny. It's a secret. It's like I said. It's a secret. It's a secret. You remember remember Chuck and Larry? It's a circle. It's a circle. Well, this is a secret. Secret. It's a secret. Hey, Jerome. What's up? Brad, what is up, buddy? Oh, Nice. Very cool. Hey, everybody. Let's show Brad some love, man. He's from a hometown. Went to high school with Brad. Very cool, brother. Thank you for joining the live stream tonight, man. Please, everybody. Brad's new to the channel. Help me welcome him here. That is very cool. Right on. Very cool, Brad. Glad to see you, brother. It's a secret, Christine. I can't tell. It's a secret. It's a secret. Oh, Triple E. Oh, thank you, brother. Thank you so much, Triple E. You rock, man. You absolutely rock, brother. Thank you so much. But first thing we're going to talk about, we're going to talk about this. This is the knife that, or knife, I'm so used to showing knives, coin that comes from Ryloth Relics. Everybody, Christine just gave everybody a bad image in their head now. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> but yes, and I, I saw these, I actually saw them on a, on a Facebook group. I'm um, not, oh, I can't remember which one. It wasn't Edge Addicted. I can't remember which one. 
It was, but I, I saw him and I was like, oh, I've got to check these out. And then I came across this coin. And this is just, this is just really awesome. Um, I ended up getting two of them. I got one for myself. I got one for my oldest son because him and I are both uh, Boba Fett, Mandalorian, you know, f freaks-ish, if you will. And can it spin? I haven't tried spinning it yet. I haven't tried spinning it yet. But it's really cool because on the back, I have to look at it because I want to get exactly what it says. But on the back, it's in Mandalorian. It says, fate sometimes steps in to rescue the wretched. And... Ah, you know what? I just, I love that. I love that motto. Fate sometimes steps in to rescue the wretched. And I just, I think that is absolutely cool. And no, not Star Trek, please. Blech. Blech. So... Uh, somebody's messaging me. Sorry, guys. Keeps popping up on the screen. But I'm just, I love the myth mythosaur, the mythosaur skull there. My son actually has it tattooed on his, on his calf. So, yeah, and that's actually, uh, after, of course, after the fact, I kind of realized that that was, you know, Boba from The Mandalorian when he's standing there. I realized it after the fact. But... Now, Ryloth Relics, it's all it's all Star Wars related stuff. You know, I know not everybody's a Star Wars fan. I get that, but I am and I like coins. So no, nah, I'm not really a Trekkie. It never really been I, I did watch Next Generation for a while. For you know, I, I did watch Next Generation for a while, but I was never, never really a, a, a true Trekkie. You know, I, I'm a Star Wars guy. War is not Trek. That's me. So, yeah. So, if you guys are Star Wars fans, interested in some coins, they've got some really cool coins. Check out Ryloth Relics. Zach has thrown up the uh, this link there a couple of times. So, please feel free to check those out. <laughs> Dave, David's making Katie do a face palm. He likes them both. <laughs> yeah, and a lot of people are. Yeah, for sure. Grogu rocks. Yes, yes. Grogu? Grogu? Yes, Grogu? Yes. Mm-hmm. Yes, indeedy. Yeah, and a lot of people like the whole, you know, the sci- Exactly, Peter, the sci-fi as a whole. You know, Babylon 5, Star Trek, Star Wars, Stargate, all that good stuff. Yes, yes, yes. For sure. I did watch Stargate for a little while. Uh, never really grabbed on like I did some of the other stuff. That's cool, Mike. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, David. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> Cheeky Nuggies? Yes, yes. Firefly was good. Yes, Jan. Firefly was good. I loved Firefly. And it, it just, it was so short. Never caught on. But then, of course, yeah, you know, Boba sits here. He's one of the review crew. He doesn't say anything. He just kind of hangs out. But if you check this out, I know my face got really close to the camera. But Grogu has even got his little frog. So. Grogu and his little froggy. <laughs> you know, I don't know exactly what they consider a blemish coin. I mean, obviously, I'm guessing, you know, like maybe some of the some of the coloring didn't, you know, there's a spot where the coloring didn't take, you know, I, I didn't I haven't really asked what a blemish coin really meant. Obviously, it just means it's not perfect, obviously, you know, and it could be something very minute, you know, and you'll find out. I mean, you'll find that a lot of when I've ordered. Oh, what was it? that I ordered that was blemished. I ordered something, 
And you, you really couldn't tell. You wouldn't, but I mean, the QC was, hey, we saw this, we can't sell it as. So, I mean, there you know a company is really on top of the QC. If you, if you can't even tell something is blemished and they're selling it as blemished. Well, trust me, Casey, I am too. I, I, I am blemished at the moment. My face, that's not nice, KJ. You want me to send you a red PM2, you want me to send you a blue ALOX, but yet you make comments like that? No, 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 no. No. Farscape, uh, you know, I never really watched Farscape. Oh, for sure, Brad. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the Black Saber, right on. It could be blemish wash. Yeah, who knows? I am I am definitely I am definitely blemished. <laughs> What's up, Justin? OCD for EDC is here. What's happening? Can I send you a cable repair guy? <laughs> well, you know I have my issues as well. But yes, and Zach just pointed out a very, very good thing. Happy birthday to Justin. Let's all wish Justin a happy birthday. I'm going to give him a little SKL love for his happy birthday tonight. Happy birthday, Justin. Very cool. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, we might have to call Chuck. That, that's a good thing, Didier. Zach, do you want me to send... Where's Chuck? Where's Chuck? Where is he? Where'd he go? I don't even... He's over here somewhere. He was, anyway. Where'd Chuck go? Well, I guess Chuck quit. Oh, there he is. Do I need to send Chuck, Zach? Do I need to send Chuck? Does he need to come talk to everybody? Happy birthday to Justin. Yes, there you go. Look at all this. Lost boy Chuck. <laughs> Little red A <aid> Chuck. <laughs> send hashtag send Chuck. <laughs> all right, I'll talk to him. I'll see I'll see if he's up for the trip, man. Oh, Triple E, you out, man? All right. Take it easy, buddy. Thank you so much for your donation, man. Good to see you. Thank you for joining. Oh, hey, James Harrison, welcome. I did not see you jump in there real quick. How you doing? Chicago's here, too. Hello. I don't think I said hello to you yet. Pioneer. Pioneer's jumping in. Hello. Welcome. Yes. So what was that? What was that you were eating for your birthday? Looked like a big old steak and maybe some cheese fries. That looked like a pretty, uh, pretty decent birthday dinner. Alex, Alex, that's a very good question, Alex. Why do people carry a coin? Um, it really kind of started in the military, uh, the challenge coin. And it was just to see, it was basically kind of who has the bigger coin in this aspect. And if you had the biggest, if somebody challenged you to show your coin and say you had a admiral's coin and they only had a captain's coin, then they would have to buy the drinks. That's kind of where it kind of starts from. As far as I, I mean, me being military, that's kind of my background with it. So, but, and, and it's carried over to, to the civilian world. And I know, uh, law enforcement and firefighters and stuff it's pretty big there as well so let's see he had a bone-in ribeye and some bacon cheese steak fries at texas roadhouse that sounds like a pretty darn good birthday dinner for sure yeah there you go some people carry a coin to make decisions flip it Yeah, and there's another one. You carry a coin for the river sticks. Yep, to pay the boat the ferryman for the river sticks. Sure. Yep. Yeah, first it's big, but it's big, but uh, with first responders as well. Yep. Very cool. Oh yes, thank you, Zach. One minute knife review. Got a really wicked giveaway going on right now. Make sure you check it out. Uh, Zach just threw the link up there. 
So actually, Bees just did his 400 giveaway. He just did the drawing for that. So got a wee bit fatter. Yeah. <laughs> well, hey, what the heck, right? Yep. Oh, Russ, you just got a Navy coin. Very cool. Very cool. Oh, James, you had a tough week? I hear you, man. I hear you. Sorry to hear that. Sorry to hear you had a tough week, buddy. There's been a little bit of that going around, unfortunately. Yeah. Yep, definitely. For sure. For sure. Sorry to hear that, man. But I do have... I do have one knife to show, to talk about. This one actually just came in the mail today. Yeah, please make sure you guys go check out One Minute's uh, giveaway for sure. Yeah, some people don't. Some people don't carry coins. And like I said, mine's just kind of a holdover from the military. So, yeah, there you go. Zach just threw up one for DNA lasering. Rule number nine, always carry a knife. Come on now. Yeah. Gibbs is right, man. Always carry a knife. Rule number nine. I have one of those. It's back there somewhere. Let's see. Rub, rub. Do I have it? There it is. Here it is. I got it. I got it. There you go. Rule number nine. Rule number nine. Never go anywhere without a knife. Yeah, that comes from DNA Lasering. They make some really cool coins as well. Uh, I'm pretty sure they've got a couple of Star Wars coins also. So that's a two-for-one deal there. But, yep, never go anywhere without a knife. Two is one and one is none. That is correct. Old school copper Star Wars coin. Right on. Oh, you're seeing some buffer in there, Tom. Sorry, man. <laughs> All right, Gary. Best knife you can have is the one you have on you. Yep. I would have to agree with that. I would have to agree with that for sure. So, we got a knife tonight. Oh, that would be cool, Brent. The zombie land rules. Yes, that would be cool. That would be awesome. But we have a TRM Shadow. Very nice. This one comes, I'm just going to say it comes from Adrian. I didn't ask him if I can, if I can say his name on camera, so I won't. But this is the TRM Adam, or TRM, God, Shadow, too many Christmas, TRM Shadow. Yeah, I just got it today, so I'm just kind of getting a feel for it. But man, it feels good. It feels really good in hand. And you've got the you got the access style lock on it. Fairly deep carry clip, recessed pocket clip screws. And this is what they were talking about. They wanted to make a true ambidextrous knife with this one. And you know, I think they pretty much knocked it out of the park, to be perfectly honest with you. Because the blade, and I've heard some people say about the handle to blade. Oh, this is the one. Oh, well, that explains it, Didier. That explains it. Okay. So, everybody, this is Didier's knife. This is Didier's knife. Okay. That makes a lot more sense. Okay. Whew. I thought I was going a little bit crazy. I thought I was going a little crazy, but... Riverlock, thank you. Thank you. That makes a whole lot more sense. I'm like, okay. I was really like, all right. I'm pretty sure I don't remember talking to anybody about sending me a shadow to look at. So thank you, Didier. Thank you very much. That makes a whole lot more sense. I mean, I think I even asked Zach, hey, man, does this name sound familiar to you? Because I was lost. I was lost. So I was really trying to be really kind of diplomatic, 
This is the Three Rivers Manufacturing Shadow, Brad. That's what this was. TRM Shadow. And my buddy Zach just threw up a link up above there um, if you want to check it out. So this, this makes a whole lot more sense. Okay. Well, I can tell you right now, Didier, I've only had this for like a very few hours. And um, yeah, <laughs> yeah, I'm liking it. Nice, big belly on this one that reverse kind of reverse tantoish style blade and it feels absolutely wonderful in hand oh my goodness hello donkey dave how are you thank you buddy thank you didier yes if you don't mind i i will definitely check this one out a little bit more in depth because this is a very very nice knife Have another beer? Sure, have another beer. Have as many as you want. Just keep it, Didier won't, won't mind. Yeah, he might. He might mind. I, I'm thinking he might. Have I said hi to you, Marcos? If I haven't, hello, and I'm very sorry if I haven't. But yes, this is stuff we do. What is up? You're back. Very good. How can I win that? Well, um, I don't think you can win this one. Because I don't think DDA wants me to give this one away. Um, what was the link to the shadow? Zach, if you don't mind, could you throw up that link to the shadow one more time, please? I would greatly appreciate it. And when he does, he also show Zach some love. Guys, if you aren't subscribed to Zach's channel, please, please do so. I don't know why you would be subscribed to me and not subscribed to Zach. But there you go. There's the link to the shadow. But please, well, that's the thing, Last Ranger. With these shadows and, and knives like this, now right now you might have to do a little bit of secondary market. You know, or sign up for their um, newsletter um, on the and find out if and when they're going to do another drop. That is the best thing. That is the best thing for you to do. They are currently sold out, yes. So, I'm going to give Zach some love, too. Yes, yes, they are out of stock. Yep. That's what happens with TRM knives, guys. When TRM makes a drop, those knives go quick. They go quick. So, the best thing you can do is sign up. You know, sign up for their email alerts and that type of thing from the website. Because... They do, they do drops every once in a while, you know, and then it might be a while before they do another drop. <laughs> do you have a cheat code that lets you to subscribe twice? Right on. Yeah, it, it, exactly, exactly, Justin. Um, guys, when these things, yeah, and that's a good, that's a good thing too, BH, uh, their Facebook group, that's another way. There you go. First full production, late September, early October. That's how you guys got to find out. Late September, early October is when it's planned right now. So sign up for those email alerts. Go to the Facebook page. Sign up there. Get on there. If you got Instagram, get on their Instagram account. That's how you know. That's how you're going to find out when these drops come. So... It's it's just it's just the way it is. Uh, maybe during Blade Show West, you know, that's a good. You never know, Lorenzo. Maybe they might release. They might have some up Blade Show West. Who knows? There's Winchester. What's up, buddy? <laughs> Leave it to Winchester to come in with that. Cows jumping over the moons and all that other good stuff. My goodness, Winchester is definitely in the house very good glad to have you my friend but i mean it is i mean just golly this is a super knife super super knife schrodinger's knives they exist but not yeah that's a good yeah schrodinger's knives they do exist just not all the time <laughs> oh yes very very out of stock spells drop in TRM speak. 
But yeah, I mean, that's really what you guys have to do for these TRM knives because they are wickedly popular and, you know, rightfully so. I don't have an Atom. I kind of prefer the Neutron. I have a Neutron and I just like, oh, bye-bye. Are you leaving, Jerome? Uh-oh. Well, if you're leaving us, my friend, thank you for joining us as long as you did. Oh, it definitely is. It it, it definitely is left-handed friendly. I mean, I'm I'm not left-handed, and I can I can operate this knife very very easily left-handed. All I have to do is swap the clip, and I'm good to go. So yeah, I mean, it's a lot of like you know, pretty much all of your access style knives. You know, you got a lot of them, obviously bench made. Um. The Able Lock from uh, Hogue, so yeah, that was their that was their big thing with this one. And uh, to me, it's a it's a good one. Hey Zach, what is up? Not Zach stuff, just Zach this time. Yeah, there you go. Justin's left-handed, and he said the shadow is fantastic. So, and like I said, oh Zach, holy cow, Zach! Thank you so much. Oh. Wow. Thank you so much, my friend. I will get it. I will get it to you, my friend. I, I really will. I, I greatly appreciate that. And I really, really appreciate you clearing things up for me because I was a little lost. I'm like, man, I know it's been a rough week, but I sure don't remember anybody telling me they were sending me a TRM. Uh... If you're not a moderator, Brad, it's hard to send links in the in the chat. So um, you can email it if you want to email it to me, bigrededc at gmail.com. I'd gladly take a look at it for sure. You might have to drive north and fondle the shadow. <laughs> All right, then. <laughs> that sounds like a date. Woo. No, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> oh, eggs and ham. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I'm talking about the knife. That is not a euphemism. I know. I know. Sorry. Sorry about that. But, yeah. I tell you what, it's worth the drive. I I'm liking it. I'm liking it. You're 23 months from getting your <laughs> North Arms. <laughs> oh, hashtag love connection. There you go. There you go. Oh, George. Oh, thank you, my friend. Thank you very much. Oh, Zach can look it up. Yeah, he said it was Sniper Knives. Sniper Knives. I'm not, that's one I'm not familiar with, but then again, I don't know everything. Is there a giveaway today? There's always a giveaway, James. There is always a giveaway at the end of SKL. When that is, it's when it ends. I don't know. I usually try to keep it away around an hour, but we go an hour and a half. Oh, there you go. Zach just threw it up. Sniper Blade Works. Thank you, Zach. Thank you very much. Thank you for throwing that up there. I will definitely check that out. Didier. Yes. Hashtag yes. Team hashtag DSKFS from Europe. Yes. Thank you very much. Oh, she likes auto. She's carrying a Kershaw auto. Oh, that's very cool. That's very cool. I have one. I have one Kershaw Auto. I do. That is the Launch 7. Launch 7, yes. Beefer, thank you, Mother. Thank you so much. What are people's opinions on the Malia, Alex would like to know. Thank you, Beefer, again. Alex would like to know what's the opinion of the Malia. I get mine, Jade, on Tuesday. I like the Malia. It was a fun little knife. Um, yeah, it was a nice carry. Good little, good little secondary blade. I would definitely put it in the secondary blade category because of its size. Um, but yeah, I had nothing wrong with it. Uh, there's a particular sniper model that looks outstanding. Can I send the model link on Facebook? Yeah, yeah. Shoot me a message on Facebook, man. Do it. I'll check it out. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. 
Z-Man likes his. Christine likes it. Top Dog says it's his favorite. Fifth carry, there you go. Peter says it's well made, but it's itsy bitsy. We know Peter's thoughts on small knives, so that's good. <laughs> uh, yeah, it, it, it's a good little knife. I agree, Zeb. I agree. It's a, it's a good little knife. Good little design. Hey, what is up, Jay Evans? I don't think I've said hi to you. So, hello. How are you? You know, it is small, though. So if you have larger hands, you know, not a, not, not everybody with a... <laughs> Zach conceals like TPK. Oh, TMI. 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 <laughs> hey, Joe, what is up? Lancelot Leather's in the house. How you doing, man? Very, very good to have you. So very cool. Very cool. <laughs> well, yeah, Peter has big hands. That's just the way it is. You know what they say about guys with big hands? They have pretty big hearts, too. Uh, not right, Peter. KC likes that crew wear dragon fly true for a fifth pocket knife. Very good. Yes, yes. Hashtag Peter's handful. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right. Hey guys, guess what? Got some. We'll, we'll, I'll give you a little bit of a spoiler alert. Uh, you guys got to make sure you check out. Uh, well, we had a good channel chat this week uh, with uh, Jack from Suburban Tactical Nation. Don't know if you guys had a chance to check that out. He's a really, really awesome guy. How long is shipping from Ryloth Relics? Relics? Um, I think I had mine in five, six days. Yeah, I think it was five or six days. Within a week. Wasn't bad. Wasn't bad at all. But, uh, and... Now I just completely lost my train of thought. Oh, channel chat. I uh, had a good one with Jack, Suburban Tactical Nation today. Really, really nice guy. Really great to talk to. Um, got another fun one coming next week, guys. Already got it recorded. Uh, recorded it yesterday morning. And just for... Just for... Spoiler alert. Think for us. If I say the word forest, what comes to mind? I'm playing. I'm still playing with the with the shadow. It's fun. Not forest. Not forest. Forest. Forest Endor. There you go. <laughs> How about the Mallory Designs Forest? Yes. this The Forest is the first knife up for pre-order right now from our good friend Dylan. Uh, carbon fiber, S35VN. Zach just threw a link of it up there. Guys, go check that knife out. It is a beautiful, beautiful knife. Um, I'm so very happen, happy for Dylan. Um, it's his first knife under... His own brand, Mallory Designs. Super, super happy for him. Go check out um, that link. But I did record a channel chat with Dylan yesterday morning. And that will be our channel chat for next Saturday. So, hope you guys are looking forward to that. Yes, I have mine on order for sure. Um, I know a lot of you probably do. Um but yes, please check that knife out. Um, Dylan, I'm so happy for Dylan. It's so very cool that he's got his got a knife out under his own brand now. Hey, D2, what's up, buddy? Welcome. Welcome. Yes, it is a very, very nice looking knife. And he shows that one off. And then he shows, he also shows off the uh, his Civivi model that is coming out. Oh, shoot. When did he say? August? 
watch the channel chat next week and he, and he'll tell you when it's coming out so but yes indeed uh, it was really really nice to talk to him um and chat with him i hadn't had an opportunity i don't think i've talked to him face to face since the blade show west 2019 so yeah it was really really nice uh the civivi one is the hedros if i'm not mistaken hedros somebody correct me if i'm wrong but i'm pretty sure that's the name of it so d2 is in the house very cool looking forward looking forward to that one as well uh it's another really slim slim knife which i'm i'm okay with i like slim knives like that hey john r were you actually at the usc fight or were you just at like a bar or something watching it uh who made it the the forest is made by artisan the forest is an artisan knife that was that's who did the oem for it was artisan so, yes, he did say. Now, I know I'm going to butcher this knife. Jacia, is that how you say it? Jacia, welcome. I hope I said that right. Oh, for sure, Brad. Yeah, yeah, I didn't. That was very cool. Very cool of you to, to join in and very... Very cool to have you here. Thanks a lot, man. Very, very cool. I appreciate it very much. All right. We'll talk to you later, buddy. Have a good night. And, and thanks again, seriously, for being here. I greatly appreciate it, man. So, Brad, a guy, like I said, uh, somebody I went to high school with. Very, very cool. Always good to, always good to have him here. Uh, and talk to the old friends very cool thanks a lot brad oh let's see i got my notes i need to look at my notes did i talk about everything did i talk about everything well like i said guys i had this one tonight i had this mug tonight but i don't know if you could tell but i am wearing my southern edge knife work shirt so shout out to Southern Edge Knife Works. Uh, if you're shopping there, guys, just make sure use code Big Red, fifteen percent off, and five dollar flat rate shipping uh, for whatever. And if you're looking for a knife and they don't have it on the website, email them, call them. Uh, they do a really, really. They'll get it if they can. Oh, thanks, Brad. I'll check it. I'll check definitely check it out when we're done. Really appreciate you sending that. Hey, Mark, what is up? Mark Grant's in the house. Blade Ogre 2, what's up? You thought it said sexy? Well, hmm. <laughs> but, yeah, very good. So, remember, guys, we've got some live streams tomorrow. We've got our good friend Zach, his Sunday live stream, noon, noon p.m., Make sure you catch that. Um, I just saw, I'm pretty sure I just saw a message from Justin. I'm pretty sure Justin will be going live uh, tomorrow night. He usually does. I'm guessing he will. Uh, it's 8 p.m. Central, so 6 Pacific. Zach's is noon Pacific. There you go. There's a link to Zach's channel for his Sunday live stream. I will definitely be there. Um, I'm pretty sure it's going to be available wherever Civivis are sold, Alex. I'm pretty sure it's not just Blade HQ. <clears throat> and there you go. Justin will be live at 8 p.m. tomorrow. And there you go. Peter, w Peter and Christine will be live on Christine's channel tomorrow at 2 p.m. Pacific. So there you go. Very good. And, of course, our, bu our good buddy, uh... Casey, he will be going live Monday night, KF Live. So make sure 
you make sure you you stick around, get all your Sunday live streams in, and then go live on Monday night with KC. I usually try to jump on uh, during my dinner break at work if I can. So probably probably should be able to this Monday. And then John, our good friend John, he goes live all the time. I think he's all live all the time now. So just keep your eyes open. Hey, Monster, what is up, buddy? Uh, just keep your eyes open for John because he's live all the time now. <laughs> and I can't blame him because it's fun. It's definitely, definitely fun. So uh, let's see. One more quick shout out. Guys, you guys remember our good friend Logan? Logan was the young man that really, really impressed the holy heck out of me um, when we did Jack Farm Boys Live. And, um, you know, young guy wanted to get in on it and sent me a knife through Ethan, who you guys remember, Ethan is in boot camp right now. He's in Navy boot camp. So shout out to Ethan too. Uh, but Logan, he started a channel, uh, talked to me quite a bit about it. And you guys, he's doing great, Gregory. He's doing great. And his channel actually just hit 100 subscribers. So he's going to be doing a, a, a 100 subscriber giveaway. I sent him, I sent him a couple of things today to help him out with his 100 subscriber giveaway. So just keep a just keep an eye open for that. And there Zach threw up a link to his channel. Go say hi to Logan. Tell him hi, encourage him. He's doing good stuff. You know, he's trying. He really enjoys knives, he really enjoys the community and really wants to be a part of the community and I am definitely definitely all about helping him feel welcome in the community. So definitely, yeah, he was in the chat. I don't, I'm not sure if he's still here. He was in the chat earlier. I didn't see him say goodbye, but um, I know he was here earlier. So if you guys haven't, uh, keep your eyes open for that. He's going to be doing a 100 sub giveaway. That's real. There he is. Oh, no, that's okay. Just giving you a shout out there, Logan. And... He's going to have some stuff for his chat or for his uh, giveaway. So I sent him a couple little things. So very cool. Very, I, I want to definitely, definitely want to feel him welcome and encourage him to be a part of the EDC community without a doubt. Kind of, you know, him, Shredder, I mean, Justin, the knife dude, young guys, they're the next generation. They're the next generation of the EDC community. And... You know, we want to encourage that as much as possible. So very, very cool. Very cool. So, well, I think I talked about everything. Did I talk about everything? I'm going to check my notes here. Do, 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 do. <laughs> yeah, I think I covered everything. Wow. All right. All right, Casey. See you later, man. Have a good Sunday. Have a great week, and if I don't if I don't see you on the lives tomorrow, hopefully I'll see you on your live Monday night. But I'm sure I'll probably talk to you at some point tomorrow. What are notes? What are notes? Notes are my brain, Peter. That's what notes are. If it doesn't get written down, it doesn't happen, and that's kind of what I was concerned me about the shadow <laughs> because I didn't have anything written down. So, yes. So definitely, definitely. He does. Casey needs his beauty sleep. I need my beauty sleep. So, yes. Make sure you guys uh, give Zach some love again for throwing up all those links. Man, he was popping them off there when I was talking about everybody going live. So... Definitely give Zach some love for that. Very, very, very thankful to have him here and to have him helping me out. It, it, man, it does wonders 
when you have somebody helping you out enough like that. So thank you again, Zach. And as I said, you know, Zach threw his link up there before and he's welcome to do it again. If you're not, if you're subscribed to me and not subscribed to Zach, that's, that's just wrong. <laughs> it is. <laughs> it is. Yes. Notes are life. Notes are life. And if I don't have notes, it doesn't happen. So sorry, old brain, whatever you want to call it. It's the truth. So yes, exactly. B for <laughs> exactly. What's blasphemy? Who's what? Who? Where? What are we blaspheming about? People helping people. Exactly. Hashtag people helping people. Hashtag DSKFS. Yes. Logan's Run. Oh, that would be a good name. That would be a good name for a channel. Uh, Blade Ops website. Haven't done a whole lot on Blade Ops. Haven't really. Honestly, I haven't been a whole lot. I haven't really checked. I've checked it out, but I haven't really, I've never really ordered anything from them or anything like that. So, yeah, I really, I really can't speak on the website because I just haven't done a lot with it. So, and yes, I do have my cherry limeade. I actually have a backup can of cherry limeade tonight. Oh, and I found a good one. I found a good one this week. They also have a black cherry one. Ooh, it's tasty. The black cherry is good, too. Oh, that's blasphemy. Gotcha, Russ. <laughs> I gotcha. Nice. But yes, the cherry limeade and the black cherry. Mm, another good one. We might have to substitute, go off and off with the cherry limeade and the black cherry. But... How about a giveaway? What do you guys think? Time to do a giveaway? I think so. I think it's about time to do a giveaway. It, it is tasty. I love knives. It's very tasty. The black cherry is good. Oh, is Logan out? All right, man. Take, take it easy, Logan. We're getting ready to do a giveaway. So you can always, always hang out. By the way. Hey, JC. What is up? Oh, yeah, we have a few. We have a few, Didier. This one's a, just a, like bubbly water. You know, it's like seltzer water. So it says it doesn't have any sugar and all that good stuff, So, which is good because I don't need a lot of that. But, yes, smash that like button. Definitely do that. So, we're going to be doing a giveaway tonight. It's a little bit different. A little bit different view on the giveaway. But, you guys noticed the title. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Zach's killing it. Zach's killing it with more of those links. There is the Cherry Limeade link from Walmart. Clear American. Yes, indeedy. That is what it is. Clear American. From Walmart, it's good stuff, though. Good stuff. And I just got really, really thirsty all of a sudden. So, Super Swag Saturday. Super Swag SKL. That's what I called it, right? Well, there's a reason I called it. Hey, Javi Man, what's up? Hello, welcome. There is a reason I called it Super Swag SKL, because tonight's giveaway is swag crazy. We're just going to call it swag. Let's do, let's do, let's do hashtag, whoops, hashtag swag crazy. That's what, that's what we're calling it tonight. Swagtastic. Well, that's a good one. That's better than mine. Fine. Call it hashtag swagtastic. That's better than mine anyway. Swagger day. There you go. That's one. Swagalicious. Hashtag swag crazy. I like that one just because it was my idea, but there's a lot of good ones. Swag off. 
Swag Apocalypse. Oh, that's good too. God, I need to hire you guys. <laughs> Raspberry Lime Schweppes? Whoa, where'd that one come from? I've never had that one. Never had that one. That sounds sounds interesting. I'd have to try it. Yes. Yes, we're definitely, as all giveaways, you're definitely going to get the swag. We got the stickers. You guys know this. We got the stickers. We got the swag bag. The big old swag bag. Swaggerama. Look, you even got some big red chewing gum. I had to get that and add it to the swag bags. I just thought that was a nice little touch. But yes, you got some Zach stuff and some DSKFS that is kind of hiding there right now. Hey, Carlos, what's up, buddy? You do have, you got the, the big red EDC, one of these in there. And then, of course, you have the big red EDC swag, Saturday Night Live. You got the hula, the grass skirt picture. And then, of course, you just got the plethora, plethora of swag in there. Knives Fast, OCD for EDC, Southern Edge Knife Works, TPK, uh, Grady's Gear, QSP. Oh, there's a Sticker Mule coaster in there. Oh, there's one of the, the new. Oh, ooh, I got this. I got the. Oh, yeah. Are we back? I know. I got the message. I got the message. So are we back? No. No, no. Okay. Okay, good. Yeah, I got the message. I got the death message. So we need to get this going. I don't want that to happen again. So we need to get moving. I don't know what it is, but we need to get moving. Woo! Okay. So yes, swag. You're going to get a hat. You're definitely going to get a big red EDC hat. No, there's no rough weather at all. It was a beautiful day today. So, we're going to add the big red EDC hat in there. And now we were buffering, guys, so make sure you guys click that live button down in the lower left hand of your screen. Make sure you're live. Make sure the little dot next to the live is orange because I don't want you to miss this. Don't want you to miss this. So make sure you're caught up in the chat. And looky here, she made me more. No, I haven't done any fishing this weekend, Gregory. But she made me more tumblers. So we're giving away one of these tonight. Nothing on the bottom of this one because I just had her make the tumblers and use the stickers. So, and, 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 one more, one more. If, I have to say this, I have to put this qualifier in there, but if you are a size medium to 2XL or know someone that is a medium to 2XL, a Saturday Night Live t-shirt. That's our giveaway tonight. It is a Super Swag SKO. So. Uh, I've had the shirts for a little while. I just kind of sparingly give them away. Just kind of sparingly give them away on the, on, on the live streams. So. That's like I said. I have medium to 2XL, so... If it fits you or fits someone you know, you'll be good to go, which I'm sure it probably would. So, Devil Dog, what's up? He's here. The Devil Dog is here. So, that's our giveaway tonight, guys. You got the swag bag. You got the hat. You got the awesome. And just so you guys know, Devil Dog, Devil Dog 3521, it's his wife that makes these. So, super shout out to Devil Dog. 
and to Mrs. Devil Dog for making some really cool stuff. So, yes. So shout out, give Devil Dog some love. Well, I tell you what, we'll give we'll give Mrs. Devil Dog some love, and Mr. Devil Dog can share the love with her. How's that? So there we go. There's some love. All right. I have a range. I have a number already picked out. I was prepared tonight because I decided to do it this way. So I'm prepared. So the rules, one guess, one guess only from the range that I'm going to give you when Zach puts the start on the screen. Closest without going over, price is right rules. Closest without going over is the winner. My screen is the official. I will take the word of my moderators as well. And you guys always help, so we always get it figured out. But, uh, and I will give you the range once Zach puts the start on the screen. So, I'm going to hold this here. It's right here. It's in my left hand. It's right here. No trickeration. There's the start. One guess. One guess only. And I have to look at the, make sure I tell you the right. Yeah, okay. I remembered it, but it's written down. 300 to 450, guys. 300 to 450. That's your that's your range. Start your guessing. Good luck, everyone. Please, one guess, one guess only. Good luck to you all. And I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna watch and see and look at numbers as they go by, and we're gonna see how we're doing as far as the guesses go. So yes, yes, this is open to our international friends. It's open to US, it's open to international. It's just a hat and a shirt and a cup. So nothing too crazy there. You guys are always welcome. So one guess, one guess only. Not that anybody's guessing twice. I just wanted to remind you. Carlos has got a guess in. Kenny Wilson's got his guess in. Very good. Very good. There's some good guesses going on here, guys. Very good guesses. It's open to the galaxy. That is right, Didier. It is open to the galaxy. I'm going to lay the paper right there because I need to get a drink. Ah, I'm going to keep it with me. Well, you got, actually, while you guys are guessing, I'm going to pour a refill. That's an excellent idea. Oh, crack it open. Nice and bubbly. KJ says he wins. Well, maybe, maybe if you guess the right number. Uh, they seem to go pretty, they pretty, they seem to go pretty, uh, pretty high or pretty big. For what? I'm not sure what for what means, James. Jeremy, what's up? Well, I tell you what, Jeremy, you're just in time. If you want to make a guess between 300 and 450, that would mean you're just in time to win a big red EDC hat and a tumbler and a T-shirt. Well, Saturday Night Live T-shirt. Oh, Sue, I already gave the range. 300 to 450. 300 to 450 is the range, Sue. Hulk wants shirt and swag. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, you might want to refresh the stream for sure. That's kind of why I was saying, I know we had some buffering there, so that's why I was trying to say, make sure you're you're live and you're caught up because I want you guys to make sure you guys get in on this because it's super swaggy. Super swaggy. Well, that happens sometimes. That does happen sometimes. I know it happens to me. So I want to... There we go. All right. 
Sue got hers in. James got his in. Very good. Excellent. Hooray. They got their guesses in. I still have the number right here. So I think everybody, and that's usually why I wait. I, I wait a little while just in case somebody is behind a little bit. I don't I want to make sure a non-goofball only giveaway. Well, that that cuts you out. You're a big goofball. <laughs> All right. Okay, Harold got his in. All right. Whenever you're ready, Zach, I think we have waited long enough. You can go ahead and throw those stop signs up. And remember, guys, y'all were good. Y'all all were very good. I'm going to say stop. Zach's going to throw some stop signs up. There they are. Everybody was good. We did not have to get Chuck involved. That is very good. Massive Delay is my B-52's cover band name. Nice. I like it. I like it. Somebody is giving away goofballs. There's our number. 363. 363. Now, I know for a fact I saw a couple of 362's. So I have to, I'm going to go back and verify. But I know I saw a couple of 362's. I don't remember seeing a 363. But Zach will keep me honest. I know you all will keep me honest. I see a 336. And there were some that were just over. But I see a couple. Oh, let's see. Where are... And they were pretty close together. Yep. I see Jared White. I'm going to write these down just in case. And if, not, if I see a 363, well, we'll... And we got our good friend John. Grateful Panic with a 362. And I don't see any more 362s. And I don't see a 363 yet. Double checking. No. Is that what you see, Zach? You guys with me? All right. Zach says I got them both. Jared White and Grateful Panic. So... Here's what we're going to do, guys. Tiebreaker. Tiebreaker. Jared says send it to John. Okay. I can do that. I can definitely do that. So Jared has... Jared wins. All right. So Jared says give it to John. John says give it to Jared. So Jared and John, what are we going to do? And Zach's giving more donations. <laughs> Well, John refuses it. So you tell me what you want me to do, Jared. Zach refuses. So. Whoever closes loses. All right. Here's what I'm going to do. Here's what I'm going to do. Oh, Carlos. All right, guys. So these two have graciously given it up to one another and both refuse. Oh, D2. Thank you, brother. So this is exactly what we're going to do. You both refuse. Um, I'm going to do it again. I'm going to do another drawing. Because I want somebody to win these tonight. Sound good? I think it does. I really want to give these away tonight. I want somebody to walk out with them. Oh, there's your love, D2. I'm sorry, I forgot to hit enter. 
<laughs> so I, I really do. I really want to give these away to somebody tonight. So we're going to do that. I am going to do another one. So I am going to do another, I need another piece of paper. I'm going to do one more. And I'm going to do, how many do we have? 76? All right. So I'm going to do, that's the range. Nah, I can't do that because I know, some, you know, I, I know who did, who picked what number. So, oh, thank you, Peter. Thank you. Sorry. I was finding my new, so. I really want to give these up tonight, and I want you guys to guess. So, let's do. I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna do this. What's a number? All right. I have a range, and I have a number. Zero to one fifty. Zero to one fifty. One guess. One guess only. Go. I like the Logan idea. Oh crap! I missed the Logan idea. Oh, there you go, Jared. Well, sorry, guys. I, I kind of started this. I'm sorry, Logan. I didn't see that in time. My apologies. Make a guess between 0 and 150. One guess, one guess only. Same rules apply all around. 0 to 150. Whoops. I'm sorry, Jared. I did not see what you said about Logan until it was too late. So I do apologize to you. I apologize to Logan as well. John Gregory, now you're guessing. Oh, cool. Hi, how are you? Zero to 150. Y'all were too nice. I'm a turd, I know. <laughs> Zero to 150. Yes, you just got here and made a guess. That's what you need to do. If you just get here, make a guess. Zero to 150. How you doing, David? Sounds like a car racing. Where? Do a quick knife. Anything is good. All right. Well, everybody's guessing. There's the big red EDC bug out. That's always handy. That's always right here. Always handy. Lefty friendly as well as those axis style lock knives are very good do a finch uh they're they're over there i don't have any finches close by i would just picked up the civivi kai v i think that's how you say it i don't know if you say it ki v or kai v Oh, uh, uh, one guess, Dean. One guess, please. I'm going to go back and look and make sure. One guess, one guess only, please. One guess only, please. Not that one. Your first guess will be the one that counts. Well, I know, Zach, it, it is an axis lock. I know the Benchmade is the axis lock. But I said, just encompassing all axis lock style knives. That's what I was talking about. Like the Able Lock and all those. You know, you know, you know, you know. I know you know. 
I know you know. K4? Mm, I don't know about that. Just because of where the hyphen is. All right. I think everybody's got their guess in. Zach, go ahead and throw up the stop signs. Stop. Throw up the stop signs. We're going to give this swag away. We're going to give this swag away tonight. I know, Zach. I know. Ben, Zach does be, bleed bench made blue lube. I understand that. Yes. Yes. So. I threw this stop up. Well, I can do it. I can do it too. I don't have to. There we go. It's different when I'm. And it's different when I'm like this because the. It's right here. I could do it myself. <laughs> it's different. It's different. Thank you, Zach. There you go. Seventy-eight. Seventy-eight. That was the number. I know I saw some seventy-sevens. I don't know if I saw a seventy-eight, but I know I saw some seventy-sevens. So, let's see, 78, 77, Andrew Arnold with a 77. There's one, 76, there's Lorenzo with a 77. Ooh, a 76. Oh, a 79 right over the top. All right, so it looks like we have Andrew Arnold and Lorenzo with a 77. You guys agree with me? Andrew and Lorenzo. Yep, that is definitely what I'm seeing. Andrew and Lorenzo. <laughs> yep. All right, so... Now, we're going to have a runoff between Lorenzo and Andrew. Okay? Unless somebody says something, and I'll, I'll watch. Make sure I don't miss one this time. But, so, Andrew and Lorenzo, one guess, one guess only. Between 20 and 30. Round five. Fight. Yes. Yes. Round five. Andrew and Lorenzo. One guess between 20 and 30. Closest. Doesn't matter if you go over. Does not matter if you go over. Lorenzo says 25. Andrew says... Andrew says 22. Twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. So that means, Lorenzo, you are the winner, my friend. And I'm pretty sure I have your address already. Pretty sure I do. But if I don't, I'll get in touch with you. I know I know how to give, get in touch with you. So congratulations, Lorenzo. I'm pretty sure I already have your info. Yeah, I do. I have your info, Lorenzo. So, very cool. Congratulations, my friend. Uh, oh, do me a favor, Lorenzo. What's your uh, what's your shirt size? I do need to know that. I do need to know your shirt size so I can send you a, the right size shirt. That would help, wouldn't it? So, yeah, there you go. There you go. Some swag to wear for Blade Show West. Uh, what is my email? My email is bigrededc at gmail.com. There you go. There it is. You need a 2XL, Lorenzo. Very good. I will get you one in the mail. I'll get that in the mail Monday. Yep. So, wow. All right. We finally gave all the good stuff away. Thank you all so very much for joining me. For this Saturday night SKL 
Greatly, greatly appreciate it. Remember, guys, Zach goes live tomorrow at noon Pacific. Peter and Christine go live tomorrow at 2 p.m. Pacific. OCD for EDC, our good friend Justin, goes live at 8 p.m. Central, which would be 6 Pacific. And then, of course, KC goes live on Monday night at 5 p.m. Pacific, 8 p.m. Eastern. And John goes live all the time. So just watch for that. So it's great having, great talking with you guys tonight. Uh, I'll, honest with you. Honestly, guys, mate, this helped a lot today. Greatly appreciate you guys. And hopefully I will see you right here next week for another edition of Saturday Night Live. Thanks all. 10 p.m. See you next week. And then I'll see you on Zach's Live tomorrow, of course. So. Now you get to see all the stuff you don't see when I'm typing and the computer is over there. Thank you all very much for your donations tonight. The super chats, that was awesome. Thank you to those of you that just joined. Rusty rejoined Sobix. Uh, remember, if you're still here, please drop me an email, bigreddc at gmail.com, so I can get a swag, some swag out to you for becoming a channel member. Thank you guys so much, and I will see you next week. Bye-bye.